Right now at five, there was a big breakthrough today and some closure perhaps for a Norwich family. The man charged in the Gilgo Beach murders in New York has now been linked to a fourth victim, Maureen Brainerd Barnes. She was just 25 when she disappeared in 2007. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Susan Raff is telling us what broke this case. Susan? Mark, this is a huge breakthrough. The bodies of all four victims were found in 2010 on Long Island. Now, police did have DNA to link Rex Hewerman to three of the bodies, but now they have evidence to charge him with the fourth murder. Maureen Brainerd Barnes took the train from Norwich to Grand Central Station on July 6, 2007. She was never seen again. Now, 16 years later, Rex Hewerman has been charged with her murder. He said, I'm not guilty of these charges. He's looking forward to fight these charges, and, and we're doing that. DNA evidence on one single strand of hair found on Brainerd Barnes confirms the link to Hewerman. Maureen's body was found with three other women, Melissa Bartholomew, Megan Waterman, and Amber Costello near Gilgo Beach, Long Island. That was in 2010. Hewerman pleaded not guilty last year. It has been 16 years since the last time I saw my sister, 16 years since I heard her voice, because 16 years ago, she was silenced. Losing Maureen has become a wound that never truly heals. It remains a part of me. Maureen was also a young mom. I was only seven years old when my mother was murdered. Her loss drastically changed the trajectory of my life. There are countless times I needed her and she was not there. I remember she read to me every night and now I can no longer remember the sound of her voice. I wish she was here today, but she was taken from us. Police say Barnes had been restrained by three leather belts, one of which was used to tie her ankles together. The four women were believed to be sex workers. The petite 25-year-old was working as a Craigslist escort in Manhattan when she disappeared. Her remains were found three years later near the three other women's bodies, dumped along desolate Ocean Parkway on Long Island. The technology used to determine the DNA evidence is considered cutting edge. As for Hewerman, he showed no emotion today in court as he was charged with Barnes's murder. Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Susan,